we're playing the original. Yes. Look, we got we got the we got the original PlayStation controller. We got the game. Look at this. And the the PAL box art for Resident Evil 2 is so much better than the, the box art for the American version. I'm sorry. I do not like the American RE2 box art. I assume it was um yeah, just distribution. Good old Claire. It's me! <laughs> that that zombie did look too much like Leon. You okay? <laughs> Imagine if this whole Did part is just Leon seeing things. I see dead people. I love that they reused this music for the um, the remake as well. This game is is excellent. It really is. It, I think it's the perfect formula for a Resident Evil game. But I feel like the multiple campaigns. Oh man. And uh, the overall gameplay, I feel like this one is better than three, who, but it's very close. Who are you? Oh, <clears throat> you must be the new guy. Three has some really good stuff though, like the quick Leon. turn is is a game changer. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been cancelled. <laughs> the voice what acting of us. <laughs> now go. But just go. All right, mate. That's so cool. Let's go. Thank you. Guys, spam some remotes. I can do it as well. Love they sub for the one time. <gasps> oh boy. Ooh. Let's run around this thing. Later, blood. shotty right so we're gonna have to do this this is the best so i think it's 49 times you search this desk so random <laughs> and you get the film so we got Chris here with Chris Chris's desk. So this is so that explains how Chris went to Europe, which leads into Code Veronica. So Chris went to Europe to like try and shut down Umbrella, right? Leon. Leon. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out Chris of here. Chris the OG of Yeah, yeah. Ooh, the creepy little transitions between rooms. The, the the loading screens are amazing. I love them. These are incredible. And then they sometimes throw in like the surprise ones where the zombies are behind the door and stuff. I'd love to see it. So let's see what Wesker was keeping in his desk. Thank you so much, Major Bashir. Wesker, what are you doing? <laughs> I also had the main series RE games feel very lackluster. Bro, I will never forget when I got invited to play test um Umbrella Core. Yeah, Umbrella Core. Um I got invited to Capcom to play that, play test it and give like my thoughts and give feedback. And we played it, right? And they asked us for feedback. And I was like, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I like the music. <laughs> that was it, that's all I had to say. The game is not good. You remember them cheat books you used to get for, for the um from the gaming magazines, the little cheat books. They used to have like all the tips in for all the for all the magazines, like around the PlayStation like N sixty four era, like they were everywhere. Kazuya was the last character. No, there's one more. There's one more. Who do you think? The, who do you think it's gonna be? Like, I'm not even a, a into Smash like that, but I, I, I always look forward to the DLC reveals because their trailers are excellent. They do the best trailers. 
they're a perfect blend of like fan service and like showing you what the character can do. Do you know what I mean? Are you kidding me, bro? The worst dogs in any Resident Evil game are right here in this one. They're so annoying. <laughs> Family. <laughs> what is that meme? The, is the <laughs> All right, where is she? Where's Ada? Easy, love. What are you playing at? Whoa, those legs. Those polygons on those legs, bro. So hot. Sorry about that. When I saw the uniform, <laughs> Sorry I about that. <laughs> He's like, it's okay. He like shot him in the leg. <laughs> cool. I bet I'm poisoned. It's going to be my luck. Watch. Polo trap video F word. Oh my god, I fucking died laughing. They were just walking through um Katavisa and they got stopped by some uh some bros that wanted them to be in their video. Fully broke down in tears of laughter. Oh my god, it's so funny. Like they're proper like my name's Leon. You see like Javits like proper oh, it's so funny. F word would have some moves. <laughs> no, no, of course not. Femi <laughs> He's one of the most uncoordinated guys ever. Oh, this part's gross, by the way. This part, like, on, freaked me out answer. when I was a kid. Damn. New one, a remake of Sonic 06? Hope not. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. Fuck Sonic 06. <laughs> it's the shittiest, one of the shittiest games I've ever played in my entire life. It's actually stressful. Like, like, there's not many games where it's, like, actually stressful to play. It's stressful to play a game that should be fun. Why is that? Why am I getting stressed just thinking about it? Hang in there, ben. I'm actually getting angry thinking about how bad that game is. Look at this. I remember seeing that screenshot in a gaming magazine, yeah? And I was like, oh, oh my god. That was like the most violent thing I've ever seen in a video game before. The umbrella boys. Look at this classic cutscene, man. It's sheer My precious they redid all these cutscenes on the um, the no Wii ones, didn't they? Take you away Umbrella Chronicles. You might hit the sample. <laughs> Just absolutely That's mugged him. Right. Alpha team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Play GT3 and 4. Yeah, no, the Gran Turismo games were huge because they're, they're, they had never been like a like a racing simulator like, like that before. What, what is this thing? Fire! Fire! Why, why is it that like they always miss. Like in movies, games, whatever it is. If they're just firing a machine gun, like 10 feet away from them, they can never hit the target. Proper snowing here in the UK, like a few months back. I was just sitting here in my room, just working. And I just heard like, doof. And I was like, what? And I ran to the window and, it was, and someone had thrown a snowball, like a big snowball at my window. I'm not joking, right? I'm actually quite lucky that I didn't go through because it sound it was loud. There was a loud fucking noise. Paperboy moment? Yes, it was. I'm not kidding. A proper a proper loud doof on the window. And I was like. What is happening? Why are you 
you son of a <laughs> <laughs> I love that part. I love that part. And they yelling at young kids, get off my lawn, you damn kids. Clint Eastwood's in Grand Tour. What? Man, Gran Turismo. That game was super popular. I never really Leon. thought too much of it. We throwing things around. <laughs> oh, shit. Look at this weird mashed up little face in there. Is this the Magnum? Bitch. So the plant dudes now, yeah. It's worth using the flamethrower for these guys because they're just frustrating to fight otherwise. Actually nearly died there, fellas. Got him. Yo, random gift in the sub? Come on. Let's go. Nice. You have to time that perfectly because if you don't, you get hit with, they, they get that free damage. And I hope you guys enjoyed the close qualifiers for IWO. That was a lot of fun. Um, the regionals are next. You know what? I fly out there to Poland in, I guess now two days. On Thursday, I'm out there. I'm going to be in the land of I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna witness Rob TV cutting a steak with a butter knife in person. I'm I feel blessed. Like that. I'm actually not joking. The, the worst thing I've ever seen. Gimme that. Gimme that upgrade. The Magnum parts. Oh my god. Fucking broken. Whoa, what the hell? What the hell? No, I don't think I've ever seen that in this game. I've played this game for many years and I don't think I've ever seen that. Look! What is going on? <laughs> He's really walking around with no head. There we go, we got the discus. You murdered my husband i know what you're looking for why can't we have games like this anymore it looks like the developers before more powerful storytelling makes you feel in horror because these old games hey, oh! wah, wah. because these old games uh you still need to use your imagination somewhat and like Back in the day, this looked spectacular. Like, this was a groundbreaking game when this came out. They had to do more with less. Exactly, Phantom. I've been waiting for you, Leo. What, what are you doing? You know what this is about. So just hand over the G virus. What are you doing? I don't believe this. Annette was right. Will you stream Silent Hill 2 or 3? I have streamed them both in the past. I have streamed them both in the past. But um, Silent Hill 2 is one of my favorite games ever made. So he's Rage 4 DLC. More di like, who, like, who's in it, though? Shiva? Did that already come out? Oh, she's dead. Ada! Voice acting. Okay, last boss time. Five 
credits until detonation. Thunder Force 4. Yeah, Thunder Force has great music. Thunder Force is fucking hard, though. The new horror Tormented Souls. I haven't played it. Or is it a movie? I don't. I, I, I haven't heard of it. This version of Birkin looks fucking crazy, by the way. Looks like something out of Castlevania, doesn't it? Turns into the doggo version. Traded on the last hit. That eye moving around while it's dead is creepy as shit. There we go. Game finished. Let's see what how, how we did. Hey, we got an A. Let's go. So that's the highest rank in the game.